Well, I'm back again. Hope you're not getting sick and tired of me. But I'm here to do a little uplifting today because I hear that there are some who's allowing this thing to really get to them. But if you allow belief and faith to come forth, then hope will take over and you will find that sooner or later, Everything will be all right. But you have to learn to place your problems and your trouble in God's hands. A lot of us at times seems to want to straighten out our problems all by ourselves. But let me tell you this one thing. When a problem gets too big for you, it's just right for God. Just give it to him and put your hand in his hand. Let him create in you a right man and things that follow will be all right. I want to talk to you just for a few few minutes concerning faith behind the dark cloud faith behind the dark cloud behind every dark cloud the sun will shine look for the dark cloud and wait till the sun shines on you evidence is recognizable by your faith you think you recognize the thing that faith produced, not entirely so. You recognize what was produced by your faith. Now, in order for me to prove what I just said, I must bring faith down to a lower level of understanding. Instead of requoting scripture, which I'm going to do, subject of things hoped for, Evidence of things not seen. Now, this is what the word says faith is. Then I will tell you in layman's terms, in my terms, rather, faith is outer evidence of an inner spiritual association. You must have faith in God because all of the power is in his spirit, not by power, not by might but by my spirit. That's what God says. Believe that you will receive it, then use your faith to thrust it into existence. Let me say that again. Look at what your desire is. Believe that you will receive it. Then use your will, or your faith rather, to thrust it into existence. Let the experience you're having with coronavirus open your eyes of understanding. Make what you thought you could be what you really are. We must learn to use bad experience to make good people. If you did not know who you were before coronavirus, all of a sudden now you know. It's either going to make a coward of you or it's going to make someone who will stand up and face their problems. The cloud that was trouble, which is this virus, is being replaced with sunshine. Yes, it's still there. We still have to wear our masks. We still have to stay home. But if you would look with your eyes and see what faith will one day bring, close the natural eyes that you're using now because you can't see what you thought you could. Sight is really sight 
when you are spiritually mature enough to allow the eyes of God to guide your spirit. Now you listen, listen to me now, listen to me good. Lots of people are saying right now, it's not over till it's over. People love to say that, especially when they're in controversial situations. But I say it's over now if God says so. Remember, you can only see up to the corner of the street. God sees around the bend. Trust God. He knows. Bless you.